in a sense, we are very lucky to have the opportunity to propose these ideas of the big balconies in this city of Montpellier because, yeah, this is a place of the really beautiful sunlight and the nice weather. So I, yeah, we, we studied a lot about Montpellier and we learned people in Montpellier enjoy the life on outside and uh, on the terraces. So we try to translate those kind of a uh, lifestyle of people in Montpellier into the contemporary architecture or into the future lifestyle. And this is quite natural to make those kind of large balconies for the platforms for people to uh, have a life on outside and create an inside and outside relationships. So I was born and grown up in the more nature field in the northern island of Japan. So in my mind, I think I have those kind of a playing in the natures or enjoying the natures, those kind of a feelings I have. And now I'm living in Tokyo. It's like a super artificial city. But even in living in Tokyo, I feel I could find some small pieces of the natures or I could find some uh, like uh, the nice mixtures of the nature and the artificial things. So that kind of a, yeah, integrations or mixtures of nature architecture is quite personal and the architectural thinking of me. I think the people like to enjoy such an open uh, life on outside, enjoy sunlight and wind and uh, nature's. That is quite fundamental, how to say, desire of the people, I believe. And if he can provide, or if he can propose the nice uh, platforms for that, then the yeah, people just think, wow, this is it, and we can enjoy, we can imagine how we can enjoy that. So those kind of a, a nice mutual uh, relationships of the, the Arctic proposals and uh, the living people who live there, both of us could share the fundamental ideas. <laughs>